Hashtag Elmo. Look, I don't make the rules. I am not the president of the internet. I don't know why things start trending. I don't decide what is trending. All I do is report, observe and report. And when I went to the twits, this is what happened. It was Elmo, you know, a guy in an Elmo suit at a park. I don't know what park. I'm guessing it's probably Central Park in New York. But he's, uh, he's going off. He's possibly anti-Semite. Let's watch this and we'll weigh in. Think uh, about International 2 by Henry Ford. I'm not making money because the Jewish costume company is harassing me. That's why I'm doing it. And that's why I want people to read about the International 2. Because if you start your own business in this city, Jews will harass you. Read about the International 2. <laughs> that is the scariest elbow I've ever seen in my life. Oh my god. She was gonna be sick. No, I didn't. Oh my god. He's horrible. Yeah. Okay, so he's complaining about international Jews. First of all, Elmo doesn't complain. Uh, and he's supposed to talk like this. Worst Elmo impression ever, right out the gate. Number two, Elmo's not angry about anything. Elmo's happy all the time. He just wants to be tickled. So I think this guy put the wrong outfit on. He should have been wearing like the Grinch or Oscar that lives in a damn garbage can. You know what I mean? Uh... But yeah, I don't know why he chose Elmo to go out into the park and scream about how if you try to start a business, the international Jews will reach out to you and shut you down. Thoughts? Anyone? Yeah, I think he should have picked a different suit. I don't like the Elmo suit. Yeah. That's giving off the wrong vibes. Because yeah, when you I, see Elmo, you think that he's going to say something encouraging and nice. and then well, He's just supposed to be tickled. and he, Right. He's also kind of dressed as Chewbacca a little bit with the, I don't know, what the knee pads and the, and the, the purse. man purse, the merce. What's going on here? I guess he's afraid he's going to fall and he wants to make sure that his knees doesn't get scraped yeah, up. I guess. So, Alan, you look like you might want to say something. Yeah, so, so I mean, do you do you get the impression he just wore the, the costume just to try to get attention? Or was he already performing as Elmo and then just got something stuck in his head and said, no, I've got something important to say and yeah. I'm going to go off on this? Yeah, so that's a good question. Which is first, what right. his message is mm -hmm. or what is his job may have been? Like, was he already Elmo? Yeah. And then lost it? Or was he a guy who really wanted to get his message out there and thought it'd be funnier or more uh, shared? Yeah. What's a way I, I can go viral with this? Well, right. if I go dressed as Elmo, people will record this and everybody will talk about it. I'm going to say that the costume came second. Okay. Only because he didn't attempt to do the voice. True. Elmo's up here. Well, <laughs> you know. But he could have... Just playing devil's advocate here. He could have been performing as Elmo. He could have had the voice. Right. And then just something snapped. Snapped. He's like, something triggered him. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe somebody passed him by and made a comment that he did not agree with. Right. And it set him off and he got on his tirade. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. That's a good question. Does anybody know? Leave it in the comments section if you know why this started. Why? It, I mean, I know why it's trending because, you know, you don't want to hear Elmo in a park yelling anti-Semitic. No things i can't imagine the sesame street corporation is happy with this turn of events yeah, at this point right. so when i went to twitter and i saw this you know i started looking at what other people were saying about it mm -hmm. and uh yeah a lot of it was like the actual elmo going to his twitter go oh what's going on today <laughs> what the hell <laughs> <laughs> you know? oh no people are mad at me <laughs> People think Elmo hates the Jews. <laughs> That's horrible. So, Elmo's got to remember not to say out loud what he's thinking in his head. <laughs> <laughs> and this isn't the first time Elmo's been in trouble. Didn't the uh, the original voice of Elmo get in trouble for doing some, some pervy stuff? Oh. I want to say it's seven years ago. Oh, I don't remember that. but Isaiah, get on it. Yes, Look sir. up. Uh, Elmo... <laughs> 
<laughs> negative, I don't know. Find a way to make me right. You know what I mean? Google me right. That's, that's what I'm saying. And I don't, you know, look, I don't get... So the original voice actor is Kevin Clash? Oh, Clash. It's in the name. There you go. No, um, let me know when you get the actual answer. He did something pervy, like, I don't know what it was. Anyway, it might have to do with Love on the Spectrum. That'd be hilarious if that was a full circle. But no, um, I don't get all the anti-Semitic stuff lately. Yes, I... it was sexual relations with a minor. Boom! Mm -hmm. And, wait, it says here he was cleared of three charges, but, I mean, yeah. he's still alleged. Well, he's obviously clear he's out here in public walking around, didn't get arrested. You know what I mean? But this makes it hard for you to really like Elmo. If you were... You know, what company owns Elmo? Is it Disney? No, it's not Disney. Well, I think Disney does Disney. now. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. So Disney's probably not happy. Whoever owns Elmo <laughs> probably can't be happy with the underage sex allegations. Right. Now the anti-Semiticness. Yeah. Right. Elmo, zip it. Go back to getting tickled. That's what they should do. <laughs> okay, here's what needs to happen. We need, to get, we need to get a lot of Orthodox Jewish people. Uh -huh. I'm talking the ones with the curly cues and the hats and the yarmulkes. Mm -hmm. To gang up on Elmo and don't beat him up. Just tickle the shit out of him. <laughs> okay. That's all you're going to do. Don't hit him. Don't hurt him. Just, just tickle him as much as you can. Like hard, like intense tickling. Yeah. Yeah, because I think Elmo likes the light tickling, but I don't no, know if you... You gotta this go needs to be some sort of it. punishment. Can right. Adam Sandler be the one to do it? Sure. Oh, well, he's not. I wouldn't say he's Orthodox, but he is. He's Jewish. He's sung about it, sang about it many times. All right. Well, anyway, that is what was trending on your ex.